fabulous ones welcome back to my channel i am marlo keenan and if you're new here welcome to the fabulous family today i am so super excited today is one of my best friends here on youtube and in real life sherry ward's birthday and i am dedicating this video to her it's going to be super for fun. What I'm going to do is I'm going to act like Sherry. Well, not act like Sherry. I'm going to basically do her type of makeup routine. There's going to be some laughs. I'm going to drag her a little bit because this is what we do. So it's going to be super fun. Some things may be a little bit exaggeratory. Some things will not be. But in any event, it's going to be super fun. I want to tell Sherry, I love you so much. You have been a super duper blessing in my life you've been with me already through some difficult times in my life and I just adore you point blank in a period if anybody try to come for you they got to come through me okay okay but without further ado let's go ahead and get into this happy birthday video all right all right all right let's get to it i'm so excited i'm going to be talking through this might be a longer video than normal but it's a special occasion so anyway we're just gonna start off by doing what sherry does so how she begins her makeup is she does her face first which y'all know i don't do but we're gonna do it anyway so she primes like it's nobody's business for one okay okay like primes like crazy so the first primer that I'm gonna go into is I'm going to use the no pore blem primer by touch and soleil I really do like this primer I've spoken about it several times and Sherry actually likes it as well so what I'm going to do is just put it right here in the middle of my face okay you know but Sherry puts primer all over okay she be going here with the primer so Sherry are you happy I'm gonna be imitating you today? <laughs> you know I'm gonna be dragging you too on some things, okay? So, hmm, there we go with that primer. Now that done blurred out all of my pores and all of that good jazz. Now, I'm gonna go with another primer because that's what Sherry be doing. She be priming, okay? So, I'm using the Dr. Brandt Luminizer. And the reason why I'm choosing this one is because I have dry skin okay sherry has oily skin and so i just want to add this to provide some a little bit of luminosity because sherry be going hand with the foundation okay she has oily skin and she is a full coverage gal me i'm not a full coverage gal so i'm gonna go ahead now and put that on my face i prime away <laughs> Oh my God, Sherry be doing the most. I love her so much though. We've known each other now for almost a year. And when we first met each other, it was love at first sight. I mean, we just hit it off really, really good. We polo each other all the time. We talk. I mean, she is just a wonderful person. You need to check her YouTube channel out. I will link it, of course, above and all that great stuff down below. So please go check her out. She is a love bug. I love her. It's all about you today, Sherry. Oh my God, and my friends Lou and Jasmine, check out their channels. Well, check out Lou's YouTube channel. I'll link Jasmine's like Instagram and Twitter and all that stuff down below. Go check them out too, but they're always saying, Sherry, 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 because I talk about her all the time. Sherry, Sherry, Sherry. They be teasing me. We all are friends. We all drag each other constantly. Okay, so now that that's done, I'm gonna go and prime again. <laughs> Cause why? Cause that's what Sherry does. So I'm gonna take my Slay All Day Setting Spray and I'm just gonna spray my face. Are you done yet, Sherry? Oh, wait a minute. So at this point, Sherry would pop open her fan and just be like fanning herself. But you know, I ain't got no time for all that. I got, uh, you know, the YouTuber fan. <laughs> and this is the part where Sherry will be talking about something. She'll just be going on something about that ain't got nothing to do with makeup. 
<laughs> okay, now that I'm primed to death. Now, Sherry will go, now go in with her foundation and she does have this. I'm gonna go in with NARS, my Radiant Foundation. This is in the shade Syracuse, but this is super light for me right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix it in with my, what is this? Bobbi Brown Foundation in Warm Almond. So these two are super matte foundations. Like I said before, Sherry is like, a super super duper matte person okay I'm luminous but we gonna we gonna do this why because because it's your birthday girl it is your birthday so I'm gonna mix these two to get a, a, a an appropriate shade here okay I already see I put too much but that's okay because Sherry be doing going doing the most okay so Sherry you know dots it in like such this is gonna be so full coverage because these, especially that Bobbi Brown, that Bobbi Brown foundation is matte, is all get out, okay? So, but we gonna do it, like Sherry. So Sherry, what do you have going on today? What are you doing for your birthday? Please tell the viewers, comment down below. I mean, I already know what you're doing, but you know. So, now what Sherry does, she typically goes ahead and blend, blends her foundation out with a brush. So this is what we're gonna do right now. And oh my god, I have never primed like that before. Okay, I, I'm interested to actually see how it comes. Oh lord, this foundation is like these two mixed together. Okay, I'm just saying, guys, this is so much for me. <laughs> like, I do not, <laughs> you know, be packing it on like this, but you know. So, by the way, Sherry has another channel that she developed, which is amazing. She has now two channels, and it's Essie Vogue something. I'll list it in somewhere, where you know, up here. And it's more like a, not a makeup channel, but it's like just an inspirational channel where she talks about life experience, things that people have probably went through in their lives, and just her aha moments, her church chats, just really good things for viewers to know for viewers to know about and it's just a place of peace a channel of where you could just have full disclosure without being judged and it's a really great thing that she's doing oh my god like this combo i am not mad at it goodness this is full of coverage so now what sherry does she talking about some she be on her channel talking about well i'm gonna put just a little bit more on now she's gonna put more but watch this i'm just gonna put just for the problem areas and right and she'll say that right but end up doing it all over okay so i thought you were just gonna retouch on problem areas but no she's like just on problem areas and she touches up her whole daggone face i'm like really sherry really Okay, and then this time though, she's gonna take the beauty sponge, and of course, you gotta she'll she'll wet it, prime it some more, and then she'll go ahead, and then I'm just gonna go ahead and blend that in, mm -hmm. just on my problem areas. Mm -hmm. So you see, she packing it up. Oh my God, I'm gonna look like a freaking cake face. Well, maybe I won't because I primed so much. You know what I'm saying? Cause y'all, I got dry skin and I do not wear this much makeup. Like I do not pack it on like this. You know what, I ain't, it's looking good though. I ain't gonna lie. It's looking pretty damn flawless if you ask me. Mm. And so if you guys notice, I also put my hair up. I mean, I usually, I wear my hair in a ponytail a lot anyway. But Sherry, when she films, she always, this is her hair done. Like, this is how she does her hair. So, I'm even trying to look like her. I can't fully look like her, you know, because, you know, she white and I'm not. <laughs> oh my God, guys, this is a lot of makeup. <sighs> so, if you guys don't know Sherry, she, again, she's a beautiful person. I love her to death. She is so so decent she's so you know kind and loving and she loves everybody i think sometimes she loves people sometimes too much and you know in terms of you know what i'm saying i, I believe in 
giving people the benefit of the doubt until they prove you wrong. You know what I'm saying? But once they prove you wrong, bye. But she is so loving. She just really is. Oh my God, this looks like I've got ma Ooh. I mean, it's pretty, but I just, I just, I'm just not used to wearing this much makeup. Jeez. But yeah, she's just absolutely dream. I just love her. She's been through there. She's been with me and just been so supportive of just things that has happened in my life. And, and is just so super supportive. You know, she loves me unconditionally. But who wouldn't? I'm Marlo G. Okay, so the next step that she does is conceal. Now, she does, she says it's like a kind of color corrector. I, I don't know, but she be putting on two different concealers. So she says that she puts on one that's kind of mostly towards her skin tone because it for her, she says it covers up, you know, probably, I guess more of her dark circle so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna use this concealer and I'm using ColourPop the first one I'm using the ColourPop no filter concealer and this is in the shade dark 36 and then I'm gonna go in with dark 32 don't get it twisted it, the numbers go lighter or something so 32 is actually lighter than 36 weird so then she puts that on like such and then she'll take her finger and just go ahead and blend that in Go ahead and blend that in. Just right there. All right. I don't, I, I'm so not used to doing this. I'm like, what the hell? Like, I didn't ever blend my concealer in with my fingers. So I'm, I'm, I feel like I feel, I feel like I look crazy because I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the lighter concealer. And now, from my understanding, Miss Sherry Ward she'll conceal okay like right here so let's do this you know I, actually she puts dots I think to give her a little highlight but she don't do her nose like she doesn't do one of these numbers and she doesn't do all that but I do believe she'll she'll do it around her mouth so that's what we're gonna do we're just gonna do it around the mouth you guys have no idea how bad I want to put a strip on my nose right there and you guys have no idea like I'm I'm, I'm I'm ready to do that okay for real so then she'll take the beauty sponge and then go ahead and blend that out you guys got to really check out her channel because she is so hilarious she be doing unboxing videos she subscribed to about a thousand beauty box subscriptions she's got a problem we've talked about this I'm the, she's got a problem she got boxy lugs fat fit fun allure whatever morphe timbuk2 walmart sh uh uh the shack place uh uh miss mary's house of wax I, she got every subscription box problem okay so now she'll blend this out okay which I'm doing right now oh my god guys like I I'm looking I'm surprised I don't look more matte to be honest with you I am really surprised my camera yes is still we're still rolling I have to check I'm looking flawless though I'm probably all out my mic is literally right here Okay, so now what she says, she immediately powders. So I'm gonna take my Laura Mercier because I know she uses this. I have hardly no more. Y'all know I don't be powdering under my eye like that, but you know. She takes a damn beauty sponge, and so I'm just gonna dip it in here. Oh my God, like such. And go ahead and powder under the eye. She does the under eye first. Okay, so let me get some more. Do the other one. Oh my God, and y'all, I got dry under eyes. I'm gonna look crazy. I'm gonna look like a freaking cake batter face. Doing Sherry's routine. Oh my God. Okay, so now she powders her entire face and I know she has the uh, Beauty Bakery powder. So this is what I'm going to use. My friend Lou actually, chat with Lou actually sent this to me because she had an extra one and I do like the powder. But okay guys, 
Hold on, let me, let me, let me, I, I, I have to take some water first. Let me breathe right now. Because you guys don't understand what's going to come up. Let me take a towel. <laughs> <laughs> okay because we about to powder our whole face the way Sherry does okay okay I'm gonna take the beauty sponge and you guys are ready because Sherry is Patrick star here we go <laughs> hold up hold up <laughs> now mind you <laughs> Sherry's my age. We both in our we both over 45. Just put it that way. But here's Sherry. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> and then she'd be on polo with me talking about, oh Marlo, this powder that I was using, the Jeffree Star powder, makes me look like I have a white cast. Really, Sherry? But she's steady doing this. Hold up. I ain't finished yet, guys. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, I'm not even finished yet. Hold on. <laughs> That's Sherry. So we got it all in there now? <laughs> Am I totally white? <laughs> and then she'll take a brush. And she'll brush it off. Let's do this. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. I need a denser brush. I'm still dusting. Okay, now that I am powdered off and look like a glazed donut, now it's time to bronze. So Sherry goes in with the bronzer. I'm gonna use my Fenty bronzer in Caramel Cutie and see if it's possible that I could bring myself to look like a human again. Oh my God, y'all have no idea how much that I rag on Sherry about, oh my God, I got some color. Look at that, mm. Mm? Mm. You guys have no idea how much I rag on her about her powder. I'd be like, oh my God, like I don't even see how she gets away with that. Like, as I said, we both are, you know, older, mature skin. Yes, I get she oily, but dang. Like really, Sherry? Really? We got we got we just gotta do the powder like that. We just gotta do the powder like that. Okay. Okay. But, you know, I drag her. This is what love. We drag each other all the time. That is what me and my friends do. That's how we, you know, show our love for each other. And nobody gets offended. We have fun with it. And it just is what it is. That's how we roll. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody could roll like that, but, you know, that's another conversation. But, anyway, she does, she will go down her nose. Okay? But I'm going to put like extra powder on because I have to. You guys really got to look at her videos. Oh my God. I actually look human. <laughs> but in real life, guys, I feel like it looks flawless on camera. And it does look flawless right now. You know what I mean? In real life, I just not used to having this much makeup on. It's like, for me, it's like, I am a straight up canvas. And I mean, the good thing about it, it does hide my imperfections and whatnot, but you know what? Marlo likes her imperfections. You know what I'm saying? I like that natural type of, you know, flaw, uh, non-flawless look come through my makeup. I like that look, but okay, I may have to like do this for the gram or something. But yeah, Sherry be going ham. I love you though, girl. Okay, the next step is some blush. Now, y'all know I don't even be doing blush. I ain't got no time for no blush. Again, not to say that I don't like, it's not like I hate blush. It's just something that I don't usually wear. And I will wear it, it's just 
very, very infrequently. But Sherry love her some blush. So I do have blush in my collection. I'm going to use this e.l.f. blush right here. And here it is. And I'm going to use, you know, this shade right here because this would be Sherry shade. Okay. And put the, ooh, ooh. This, okay, that was pigmented. Oh my, oh, oh crap. Oh, whatever. Wow, this is pigmented. So now I gotta make the other one right just like that. That's okay, I will blend it out somehow. So look at, look like, seriously Marlo? Like really? Oh my God. Let me try to fix this real quick. Okay, I put way too much of blush on, but that's okay. Once the look comes together, it'll be fine. I'll continue to fix it and blend it and all that jazz, but you know, Sherry a blush person, so. Okay, so the next thing she would do is highlight. I'm gonna use my Becca Prosecco Pop. I love this highlighter. Now, typically, she puts her highlighter on with a fan. I hardly never, ever do this. So, we're gonna do it like her, and also, usually, I set my face before I highlight because it just makes the highlight really pop when it's on moist skin. So, let's just go ahead and put the highlighter on like Sherry. Sherry's gonna be like laughing her butt off when she sees this video because she's gonna be like, girl, you really had to put that much powder on? I'm gonna be like, yeah, because that's what you be doing. She in denial about it though. Like she in denial, yeah, Sherry, you in denial. She in denial about how much powder she actually uses. Look at that, that's pretty. You know, and she does highlight like everybody else, you know. Oops, you know. And all the same places. I'm not used to using this fan brush, but I'm not mad at it. So yeah, Sherry's in denial. She don't want to admit it. She got a problem with powder. Now that that is done, you guys have no idea how bad I want to like set my face and get rid of this freaking powdery look. Oh my God, you guys have no idea. But I don't think Sherry does that at this time. I think she finishes her eyes and all that stuff and then she'll spray like at the very end. I think before she puts her lipstick on. So we're gonna wait. So what I'm going to do now is the time where she does her eyebrows. She doesn't usually do them on camera and I'm not neither because I ain't got no time for all that. I'm a, so I will be right back. Bam. So, whoo. Child. Okay, so I use my Holy Grail over here, Goof Proof Pencil by Benefit, and that was the struggle was real because I've never, I always do my eyebrows first, and because I had so much powder, there was so much grip when I was trying to do my eyebrows because I basically have to like draw my eyebrows in because I have non existent eyebrows. That was a struggle. They are totally distant cousins right now. Okay. Now that Sherry has gotten her eyebrows on, now she's going to prime. And so she does have the P. Louise base and that's what I'm going to use as well. I'm going to use it in Rumor Q. And we just going to put that on my hand right here. So Sherry didn't have this base and so I convinced her, I'm like, girl, you got to try it, you got to try it. I don't even know, she hasn't even talked about it like that much to me as a matter of fact. So I don't know if she like loves it, is it a medium thing for her that she likes, but she does use it. So I am going to, you know what I don't know if she does though? Or I forgot if she does do it. I forgot if she sets her eyelids before going in with shadow. Not everybody does, I think she sets her lids. But I have such extreme hooded eyes. Sherry has hooded eyes, but not as bad as mine. I wonder, I can't remember. I cannot remember. Sherry, let me know, girl. Let me know, do you set your primer? Because I've come into the habit where I don't. Sometimes I do. So then she'll take, which I have to, like this little bitty beauty sponge and just, you know blend that out okay I think I'm gonna go ahead and like set this I'm gonna use the Laura Mercier because I think she does set her eyes so we're gonna go ahead and use the Laura Mercier and we're gonna go ahead and set this base real quickly 
So as you guys know, I am super big on birthdays. Like, y'all already know, I celebrate my birthday all month. Okay? When you get to be my age, you know, we just glad that we live past 40. <laughs> so, okay, so now that that's done, okay, Miss Sherry, can you guess what palette I'm gonna go in with? I'm gonna give you a minute, guess. Wrong. <laughs> okay, so Sherry, she does very beautiful eye looks. You know, she, um, you know, does bridal style type eye looks. Very beautiful, natural, smoked out, just well blended eye looks. And her zhuzh is like rosy, pinkies, everything that I'm not. Okay. Y'all already know my channel. I be doing dramatic cut creases and all that crap. But Miss Sherry, she loves the rosy type of color. So I chose the Violet Voss Pro Eyeshadow Palette to do her eye look today. And this is a, this is a, it's a beautiful palette. I mean, it just got all these beautiful rose tone, um, mauve, even neutral colors. It's so super pretty. So this is what I busted out today. And gosh, I didn't even look at it to see where I was gonna go with it. I just knew what palette I was going to use. So this part I I'm excited about because I ain't gotta do no cut crease or nothing like that. I ain't gonna have no glitter. This is all about sheer. We're gonna do a sherry look. Okay, a nice, beautiful, blown out, just beautiful, pinky, rosy, something. Okay, okay. So let's figure out what I'm gonna go in with first. We're gonna do some tiles. So let's do a transitional shade. I'm gonna go ahead and guess what I'm gonna use, Sherry? Bestie, because I'm your bestie. fitting is that <laughs> that wasn't even planned but I'm gonna go in with the shade bestie and I'm gonna use a big fluffy brush to just go ahead and start right up here on my crease and blend it out okay I'm gonna do just like Sherry would do now I may my technique is obviously different than Sherry's and on a lot of levels only because I have extreme hooded eyes. But for this, it's a transitional shade. It's all good. We're going to blend that bestie right on out into the crease. So what I'm going to do is I'm also going to bring it right down in my uh, outer corner here. And, and just, you know, I have a lot, look, I have a lot of list space. So I'm going to bring it all the way up almost very close to my brow bone into the crease and also right there in the outer corner, okay? So I am so super excited. I really do hope that Sherry loves this video because I love her so much, you know? And I've done videos like this. I like to do birthday videos. Um, I did one for my daughter. I've done one for her. I think I did one with her. I don't know if I did it two years in a row, but I know I did a birthday video for her uh, one year. I think it's fun because you know you get to honor the person that you love and you know it just it just shows them how much you love them and respect them and also it challenges you to try to do makeup like them. You know who I'll have a struggle with when I do her uh, birthday video is probably Jennifer Locanis if I do do her birthday video. It depends on how she act because she be tripping sometimes. It depends on how she behaves she gonna get a birthday video. I'm kidding. I love Jennifer Locanis. Um, I will link her Instagram as well down below. She's an amazing artist and she is artsy fartsy. So, but we're not gonna talk about Jennifer too much because this is about Sherry, okay? So this is a really pretty color. I like this bestie color. Okay, let's continue. Okay, now, what am I gonna go into? I'm gonna go into, I'm gonna go straight in to this beautiful wine and dine color. That's what it's called. And oh my God, if this isn't her shade, I don't know what is. And so I'm gonna go ahead and blend that also into the outer corner, into the crease, deepen it up. Cause I'm trying to only use like three um, shades today it's so funny when Sherry like the way she talks like okay so look at that freaking pigment Ooh, let me tap that she'll be like we'll be pulling each other she's like Marlo it came out so pretty I really do like it that's how she talks what do you think about my eye look Marlo it looks so pretty I'm so happy the way it came out <laughs> oh 
okay sherry let's go so i'm gonna go ahead and put that right this oh my god this is such a sherry color this palette is beautiful i'm mad that i don't use it that often she'll be like oh it's so pretty I, that's her, like her favorite word she's like it came out so pretty i love when she says it because i'd be cracking up every time i'd be like okay it's pretty sherry doesn't she's not really the type to use much slang language you know where i would be like oh my god that is so dope right that's because my little whippersnappers keep me up abreast on the lingo and the slang you know what i'm saying so my little whippersnappers are Jasmine and Lou. And Jocelyn too. I'm gonna take my other brush that um, and blend, no extra product, and I'm gonna go ahead and blend a little bit more of those edges out um, with Bestie. Sherry. <sighs> so, I am so, I'm just so happy to be doing this video for her, guys. You guys have no idea how much I love her. And I'm gonna keep on saying I love her because this is her video. So I'm going to be redundant. This is, you know, this is in dedication to her. So it's almost like I feel that words can't even express how much I love her. She is just like amazing. And she's a good hearted person too. You know what I'm saying? Oh, she's just so sweet. I think what I want to do though is darken just the outer corner up because Sherry typically has her outer corner pretty you know blown out i think when she does these type of looks so i'm just gonna put a little bit more of that wine and i should darken it up with teddy bear as well and i think i might go ahead and do that in fact so but you know her eye shape is totally different than mine so you know my blown out and her blown out will look different because of our eye shape is just significantly significantly different i have a huge eyelid space where sherry does not is not as big as mine so um okay i think what i'm gonna do is go ahead and i'm gonna i am i'm gonna put this ted t or should i use brownie points i'm gonna use brownie points i'm gonna use this shade right here brownie points and i'm gonna go on top and just darken up the outer edge a little bit and i'm gonna use the same daggone brush too oh my god i probably sound so loud to you guys because my mic is right there you know i always wanted to do that <laughs> i guess i just did it happy birthday sherry i love you so much <laughs> okay i know I i'm being so silly okay let's do this brownie points just a little bit and let's see how that turns out because I do want to darken it up a little bit right here. I'm not going to go, I'm not, I'm trying not to go like above my crease. I just want it to be right there on top. Yeah, just like that, just like that, just like that. Marlo, please don't go any further. I hope I'm doing you justice, Sherry. Goodness, all this foundation I got on. Powder. Sherry, you're going to have to comment down below and tell the viewers why you be packing on the powder like that? The viewers want to know. <laughs> oh my God, I wish I could show you guys the polo where she was like, oh, I don't know why. It's just, it's giving me a white cast. Oh my God. And I mean, you it's, it's one of those things where you had to see it to believe it. Where she's saying, oh, it's giving me a white cast. But at the same time she's saying it, she packing the powder on like it's nobody's business. But I love her. You know I gotta drag you, Sherry, about that. Okay, I think that's pretty. Wait, let me say how Sherry. I think it's so pretty. <laughs> now I'm gonna go in with a shimmer shimmer. And what shimmer should I use, Sherry? I'm gonna use Cranberry Splash for the shimmer. And I'm gonna go ahead and put that right in my inner corner because that's exactly where Sherry would put it. Now, I have hooded eyes again, guys, so I'm going, you know what I'm saying? I'm probably going to bring it a little bit more above my crease than Sherry would, but it is pretty. Oh, she's going to love this look. This is such a Sherry look. Oh, my God. But I'm going to go in. I'm going to top it with something else because I want it to be lighter. So I'm going to go ahead and top it with... um 
with cool beans right here. That's a lighter shade. Hopefully it'll look right. Yes. Yes, it brightens it up. Oh. Yes, there we go. There we go. So anyway, Sherry, have you been using, because I know you have this Violet Voss palette as well. Have you been using it? Please let us know down below. You know, Sherry be all up into the bad habits. She got videos on bad habits and all them other, what is, from Hush. I, I don't even know the names because, you know, I'm, I'm not a dupe type of palette person. What's the other one? Face candy. She be knowing about all that jazz. She be doing videos like crazy on dupes. So y'all need to go watch those videos. You know me, I'm not a dupe palette person like that, to be honest with you. You know, it is what it is. I'm bougie. Okay. I don't got that many drugstore stuff or, you know, knockoffs, if you will. Only for review purposes I do. Like, you know, my James Charles one is a dupe. The Hood of Beauty video I have out is a dupe. You know, but it's really just for review purposes. However, I, I need to do it to be honest with you more because, like, they, they're good palettes. Like, that James Charles palette dupe, y'all need to check that video out because you don't know what you're missing. Don't buy that James Charles palette. So let me do some blendage. And then what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to do the lower lash line. And I'm going to do the exact same colors. I'm going to put Bestie down in there, um, Wine down, Wine and Dine, and Brownie Points. Okay, so I'm not going to, I'm going to, you know, I'm not going to show you guys that part because, you know, you guys know how to do the lower lash line. Okay. Okay, guys. <clears throat> Now that the lower lash line is done, I need to put on the eyeliner. Okay, so this guy, I'm gonna let y'all know is gonna be messed up. Okay, because she puts on her eyeliner totally different than me. So I'm gonna try to do it like her. I even have the eyeliner that she uses, which is which is good eyeliner. I just she sent one to me and I do love it. And it's the It Superhero liner. It's so so good for real, guys. Like it's very matte, very black, and it stays on. The difference is is that you know I typically do my liner with one hand because of the texture, and I use a liquid or my gel because I have so many wrinkles right there. It's hard. It, it, it's just easier for me to use a more fluid liner to go over those crinkles. But this is how she does her liner. I don't know if she does her wing first or the inner corner or the line first. But I'm gonna do it somewhat like her. So I'm gonna take the liner, okay, and I'm gonna start in the beginning and just do the line across. So let's start that. I'm gonna just do the line first. Okay, that's done. So when I tell you that Sherry is the queen of a wing eyeliner on her, it's amazing. So what she does. She apparently props herself up like this and stretches, am I in frame? I am, a little bit her skin and then starts right here at the inner corner, at the outer corner and goes up. Like such. And see, I can't do it like this. <laughs> like I can't do it like like she has her elbows and then she'll go one of these numbers okay okay and then she'll fill it in see I can't I can't do it like that like I have to like do it with one hand I'm trying Sherry I'm trying to do it like you, but I have my own method of doing my wing eyeliner, but that's how she does it. Now, this is not big enough. I feel like her liner is typically, is it? Yes, her wing is bigger. So let's try it. It's gonna come out messed up, okay? This is Sherry's video, okay? We're not doing it the way Marlo does it, so don't come for me about the liner. Okay, I'm done with the liner situation, okay? I gotta move forward. So what we're going to do is she does mascara and I'm going to put on some lashes and the lashes I'm going to put on are um, this. This is the style Orlando, I think. Um, and this is by Lily Lashes. So that's what we're going to use. So let's get to it. Guys, my eyes are watering like it's nobody's business, but this look is coming out. Okay. so. I can't wait to I can't wait till we spray. You know, I'm gonna do that right now before I even put my lipstick on. So we're gonna get this powderiness away. I'm gonna go in with my MAC Fix Plus and just spray my life away. 
Oh my God, I don't see how Sherry does it. I'm telling you, that was like, I got a lot of makeup on guys. Like I have a lot of foundation, a lot of powder, and oh uh, yes, the MAC Fix Plus took it away. But because Sherry is extra, and she likes to prime, like it's nobody's business, I used the MAC Fix Plus to go ahead and take care of that powdery look, and now I'm gonna use the Gerard Turn Off. <laughs> to slay all day, to set so it can stay on all day, like Sherry says. And here we go again. Watch my eyeliner start running from all this spray. Okay, so Sherry is a matte girl when it comes to lipstick. Go figure, matte face, matte lips, matte eyeballs, matte everything. Okay, so I'm gonna take my Gerard Cosmetics Lip Pencil in Sugar and Spice, and I'm gonna use the Hydra Matte 1995. I'm not even sure if this goes with this, but I'm gonna use this anyway because Sherry always says that she always lines her lips. She, she lines her lips whether she's wearing a matte, a gloss, a cream, whatever. So I'm just gonna go ahead, and since this is gonna go right on top, it doesn't matter anyway, so. All right, well, this is the final look. I absolutely love the way it came out. What armor to Sherry Ward. And this lipstick was just perfect with this look. In any event, I do like it. I did go ham on the blush. And I feel like, like the powderiness is definitely gone, but I haven't had this much foundation and powder on. I, and I don't know when. So in any event, Sherry, I love you so much. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was just for you. As you know, I absolutely adore and love you. I can't even express like in words how much I love you. You have been there for me. You have been a wonderful, loyal, dedicated friend, my sister in Christ. I mean, just in this short time that we have known each other uh, over this year, we've known each other for almost um, a year now, and I, 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 just, I, I just don't know what to say. I love your crazy self, okay? Even though you powder like it's nobody's business, okay? <laughs> Oh my God, I, okay, okay, I'm gonna stop because I don't know what else to say. I hope you enjoyed this look. Please guys, always, always love each other, be good to each other, there's a lot of crap going on. I always have to have my little saying at the end of certain videos like this, just be good to your friends, be good to your family, love each other, always, okay? All right, until my next video guys, I love all of you and I love you Sherry Ward and happy birthday. Bye-bye now.